Hey guys, welcome back to my small engine repair channel. And today we are working on a Husqvarna 460 chainsaw. Uh, the customer stating that the oiler is not working. Um, so I'm gonna take a look at it, see if we can figure out what is going on and get that oiler working. All right, first thing I wanna do is actually make sure there's some oil in it. Definitely oil in there. So let's take this bar off and kind of inspect. It should be similar um, setup to the last chainsaw that I worked on, which is the still, oh, which one is it? The 025. Um, I'll put a link right, right up there in my video so you can watch that one. But the clutch should spin in a little worm gear. Worm gear spins, pulls the oil, puts it on the bar. All right, the piece that turns the worm gear um, looks pretty good. Those, these are not all stripped out. And you see on the back of the clutch, um, these two little slots right here and here. On the other side of that, you can see the corresponding. And that's what sits in there, and that's what spins it when that clutch engages. And what I see, you can see the worm gear right here. It might look a little warm, but it's also highly packed with wood chips and stuff like that. Um, and also it looks like this part right here possibly got damaged. Oh, it's all tore up. But let's just, we're gonna pull this screw out and pop this whole plate off. Here's the piece that runs from the oiler up to the bar. Uh, it's still pretty pliable and looks like it should work. It's not clogged. And you can manually test these. Um, this is where the oil is going to come out. And if you spin it with your finger, you can actually see oil starting to to bubble out. So that tells me that it's picking it up from the tank, which is right behind there, and the pump is actually working correctly. Of course, can't really spin it fast enough to make it really do much, but as long as it's pulling. All right, so I suspect that all this gunk in here was causing those the teeth on this guy not to spin. All right, so let's see if we can get it to go here. Okay, spinning it by hand is not enough. Um, got it back just enough to start it, and you can see right there, plenty of oil up on there. So let's just put it back together, and then we'll make sure it's on and we should be done. Fresh oil. Yes, this is the same cardboard from a previous video, um, but this site here is definitely fresh oil. So, really, that's all it was was uh, maybe the wrong oil, and it wasn't bar oil in there. Plus, just behind everything where that worm gear was, it was just caked with, you know, wood chips and oily gunk, and that will get between those two pieces for the worm gear, 
and it will not oil. So, um, yeah, so that's a wrap on this one. If you have any questions for me, put them down in the comments below. Appreciate you watching.